Hello and welcome back to SF Giants Recap and the Giants, they walk it off against the Padres winning 3-2. Amazing game from Michael Conforto, Tyro Estrada, and Jordan Hicks. We're going to go over all that in today's video. Make sure to subscribe and like, I really do appreciate it. And so let's head into how the offense did today. The offense, it was a little quiet. Only five hits in today's showing, but they were clutch hits. Three of them were from Conforto. He had two doubles and a single, and the one single went farther than the two doubles, which it was just because it went off uh, Levi's arches, so it was kind of a bad carom for Michael Conforto. But he did end up really just getting us the win today because of the double that scored a run, and then uh, advancing the runner. He did have a base running mistake, but it got erased because Tyro Estrada, he came through with the walk-off, a really clutch, clutch uh, move by Estrada with the double. And then Matt Chapman, he scored the winning run after being hit by pitch. Just an overall great team win. We really needed this. And the Giants now are back in the win column after getting swept by the Dodgers and losing last Sunday against the Padres 13-4. to So bouncing back today is huge for the momentum. And hopefully we can continue this with Keaton Wynn being on the mound tomorrow and last outing, he did really well. And then Logan Webb being on the mound on Sunday, hoping for a bounce back start. So really good to see there. There were only a few negatives in today's game. Uh, the runners in scoring position, we still struggle. 0 for 6 today, we really have to clean up that kind of mess. We can't advance runners, we get everyone uh, in scoring position and then can never score them. So that thing needs to be addressed. We need to be situational baseball players and hit a sack fly, get a nice little bunt. That stuff, that type of stuff, will win us ball games. And we saw it today though with one situation where uh, Matt Chapman he had an infield, a little grounder that scored a run, the tying run, and he got thrown out. But still, we scored a run in that situation. And that's huge. For the pitching side of today's game, Jordan Hicks. He did really, really good today. He had five strikeouts in seven innings pitched, only allowed two runs. Just early in the game, he was a little off, but really he kept his stuff down. He was locating pitches. His slider was still really solid, had the break that you wanted, and did really well today. Uh, Tyler Rogers, he had a nasty pitch that hit a guy while striking him out. That's just how good Tyler Rogers can be at times getting those pitches to locate, and if he can w make that pitch work, like that rising slider, it's lethal. Sometimes, though, it gets caught up with him with uh, Tatis. He hit a home run on that. But other than that, it's really, really good, and today it showed up. He also got some other weak contacts. So great to see from Tyler Rogers. And then we also had Camille Duvall, he who came in. Got a little bit risky, but he got out of it with no problems, and uh, getting two strikeouts in that inning that he pitched. Another big thing for the pitching in today's game, the walks. We only allowed one walk in today's game. That is really, really good to see, and we really, and we especially need it in these close games. If you only walk one guy, that's one free pass, and you can recover from that. It's when we have three, four, we're reaching five. That Those games where we have that many walks, it really hurts us because it's free passes. You, the batters didn't do anything to really deserve that. So limiting the amount of walks we allow and getting walks on offense really contribute to if the Giants win or if we lose. So great, great win from the Giants. We have to continue this. It can't just be we get a walk off on our first home game of the year and then we just kind of drop off because that when that happens, it really hurts us because we get in like this high and then we drop down and everyone forgets about the walk off win. We need to keep this momentum, go into tomorrow and get a big win there and continue it. We can't just let go, let uh, the gas go and keep it up. So that will do it for today's recap. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time for a new SF Giants recap video.